the vagus nerve innervates a lot of our abdominal area, our chest area, particularly our gut. By innervating our gut, it has so many different functions. Vagus nerve secretes a lot of the enzymes that we use to break down food. Helps what we call gut motility. Or in other words, it just helps matter in our gut move through so we can pass it out. So constipation is exactly is an example of low vagal tone. Enzyme secretion, gut motility, acid secretion are also part of the vagus system. And also we have in the lining of our small intestine, these cells called tight junctions. Basically what they do, is they make a very permeable barrier that food, undigested food, cannot penetrate. When we have low vagal tone, that tight junction separates. And so we can get undigested food like proteins, gluten, casein, and so on, which are found in dairy products and bread products. These products can get absorbed into the body undigested. And then that's when we get things like leaky gut syndrome. I was going to say like diarrhea or leaky gut. We get food sensitivities because now our immune system, which is located in our gut, is going, what is this food coming across Mm. the barrier that's not digested? It's a foreign object. Mm. And then the body can have an an autoimmune response. And that becomes a whole host of other issues that some people get as well. 